the governor of Imo State, Hope Uzodemma, has recently wasted millions of naira in sponsoring over 1,000 Christians to Israel for pilgrimage. Can you tell me how this will contribute to the economic growth and social welfare of the Imo State people? This is the reason why I put government and religion in the same place, especially Christianity. And now you know why government does not collect tax from the church. It's because church is helping the government to distract the people by holding God responsible over the things that government is supposed to provide for the people. Now we should know the reason why. If the Imo State's Christian body should tell themselves the truth, they should have advised the governor to use this money and invest it to the people of Imo State, especially in this critical situation that there is high increase of hunger and starvation in Imo State and in Nigeria at large. But you can imagine that a government that claims that they, they represent the interest of the people could invest over a billion naira in sponsoring about 1,000 Christians to Israel. Of what benefits would this bring to the states, even to the government? Zero. This is a total waste of resources. Let me tell you briefly one thing you don't know about this Israel, the so-called Holy Land of Israel. This is Israel, I, I define Israel as a business center by the Europeans and America, to be precise. Israel is a business center by the Europeans because it was the Europeans that migrated into the today's so-called Israelis. It was the Europeans that migrated into the so-called Israelis. That they, it was the Europeans that created the state of Israel. It was the Europeans that created the story of Jesus, the story of heaven, the story of hellfire, the story of uh, Israel being a holy land. This center of tourism that Israel is today among Christians, it was a business that was strategized by the Europeans and America just to continue the extortion from Africa especially. Do you know how many billions of dollars that African governments push to Israel every year, annually, in the so-called, in the name of pilgrimage? That is why I say that, that people with power in, in Africa does not have brain, and people with brain does not have power. 